What is up beautiful people? It's your girl Cam and I am back with another video. Today I'm coming at you with just a little bit of happy mail from this past week. I didn't do a whole bunch of planner shopping so um, I just have two orders that I want to share with you but trust me what's in these two orders you want to see it okay because it's nice and I think some of these things are still available so if this is your first time visiting my channel welcome my name is Cam this is Peace of the Plans and I do hope you find something here that inspires your planning your journaling your scrapbooking your creativity if you do go ahead and click that subscribe button and don't forget to click the notification bell as well so you'll be notified every time I post new content right here for you if you are already a part of the fam welcome back and I want to tell you that what I have in these two orders is so, so nice. You do not want to miss it. So if you want to see what I picked up from Archer and Olive and Live Love Posh, stay right there. did grab her, um, I think it's called Hello Summer, I think it's called Hello Summer, sticker book, and yep, it's called Hello Summer, and y'all know, um, is her name Jessica? Yeah, Jessica. She has been on it with releasing the sticker books, okay? She's got sticker books coming left, right, center, she is ready for you, okay? And she ships really fast and the quality of the products is pretty good. So um, yeah, she sent you a little thank you note. It says, thank you so much for shopping with me. I'm truly grateful for all of your support. I hope you love your purchases and enjoy using everything. Jessica at uh, hello at liveboposh.com. Okay, cool. And then there is a coupon on the back, which I cannot show you because you need to purchase from her to get that good old coupon. So this is the sticker book that is called Hello Summer. And you can already tell from the cover, it's gonna be bright and beautiful and fun. Perfect for the summer months. So let's get into it. She used to do um, sticker books that were mainly uh, florals, but she has branched out into some other decorative elements for your planner and I think it's so so pretty and she's doing a great job with it so the colors are always beautiful and vibrant yeah very very good so here's the first page it's got some pink and blue and green you've got a girl in her um, pool chair a girl in her with her hat on and her beach towel and you have this corner cut sticker here with the two girls here at the bottom like they're about to get into the water, the pool. Here's a heart-shaped pool in the middle. Oh, this is so pretty. I just noticed that. That's very, very pretty. You have two uh, pages of that design. Ooh, and then a third page. Come on, come through. This one is a little bit different, but you've got some corner cut flowers, a larger version of the heart-shaped pool, and then the girls in their chairs, and then you've got glasses of uh, drinks and some uh, sunscreen. And then you've got two pages of this. So they're two separate pages. So you've got two copies of the first page, and then two copies of the second layout. Okay, and then, then next we've got this uh, beautiful tropical page with the orange and yellow and green and the toucan bird down here in the bottom. We have two sheets of that. And then another page that's similar called Tropical Vibes. Different versions of the flower, a smaller version of the toucan, two sheets of that. And then you have this beautiful like beachy scene with the girl with the flowers in her hair, 
some palm trees, magazines, and uh, a swimsuit, and some shorts, and florals, and then this flower in the shape of a pineapple. That is super cute. Two sheets of that. And then you have another sheet with a darker skin tone girl as the main focus here. Beautiful florals, all the deco, the pineapples, the little um, straw bag, handbag, your uh, coconut drink, oh, the little pink lemonade. So, so cute. Two sheets of that. And look at this mermaid page. So gorgeous, like under the sea type page. So you have this long shell sticker that you can use across the bottom or top of your page. You've got the mermaid tail, some seashells. Very, very pretty. Two sheets of that. And then you have a different style with, um, instead of shells across the bottom, there's water and the mermaid tails popping up out of the water, shells, coral, bubbles, all the mermaid things. <laughs> That's very, very pretty. Two sheets of that. And then you have got the uh, flamingo floaty and tropical flowers. And it looks like the girls at the bottom are on a girls trip. And they're making a the little heart shape with their hands, super cute. Got flip-flops, bag, a hat, nail polish, sunscreen, a um, watermelon popsicle, beautiful, bright, vibrant colors, and two pages of that. And then you have the same colors and um, illustrations, but different sizes and different um, like iterations of those same illustrations. You've got the little t-shirt and shorts and flip-flops, a bracelet, two ice cream cones, a bigger version of the bag with the straw hat, a smaller version of the two girls on the girls trip. So just different versions of the illustrations there. Two sheets of that. And then you've got, I want to make sure I'm not skipping any pages. Yeah. Then we've got uh, Tropical Summer. Oh, pool boy. <laughs> There's a quote right there that says, Oh, pool boy. <laughs> Sink or swim. Hello, darling. Summer's calling. And you've got watermelon, coconuts, um, like more dressy sandals, heart-shaped floats, uh, old school <laughs> cell phone, old school uh, cordless phone. That's cute. A bikini two pages of that. This is like green and pinks and a little bit of orange in there and some white. Very nice. And then more summer vibes with the tropical flowers and the coconut drinks. Two sheets of that. And this beautiful um, like red page. There's a flamingo here but he's not really pink. He's more of a red color. And this little sign says sun, beach, and relax. You've got the girl sitting here under her um, umbrella in her chair by the beach. And with their straw hats on, kicking their feet up. Two pages of that. Got like sherbet or ice cream and a little glass there. And then you've got the pink version of the flamingo. And the girl down here with the darker skin tone beautiful and then a bigger version of the sign sun beach and relax nice two sheets of that and then we've got some quotes you know live love posh always comes through with the beautiful quotes hello summer vacay vibes you can find palms uh, what you can find you can find me under the palms you had me at Aloha I'd rather be a mermaid every summer has its story beach weekend be a pineapple stand tall wear a crown and be sweet on the inside I love this whole page and the flowers are making the shape of the pineapple that is so gorgeous and you've got some corner cut flowers as well 
and you've got two sheets of that. I love these beautiful, vibrant summer colors. So that is Hello Summer by Live Love Posh, and I do believe these books are still available in her shop. Next, um, I was just scrolling through Instagram, minding my own business, <laughs> minding my own good business, when I saw one of the um, planner babes uh, showing a journal from Archer and Olive. And I can't, was it Crafty Planner Queen? I think that's who it was. But she didn't have either one of these journals. The one that she had, I was looking for it, but I think it was sold out. But I found two journals at Archer and Olive that are just stunners, y'all. Wait till you see them. They are just stunners. You know, you get this beautiful box from Archer and Olive. And you know I could not resist the pink. So let's just get right into it. Let's just make that clear. You can't resist the pink journals. And I'm super excited about this one. I have another pink journal. Um, the pages on the inside were pink as well. And I really, I was excited about it at first. But once I started thinking about writing in it, I really would prefer to have white paper. So I'm so glad that I found this pink journal with the white dot grid on the inside. And this has the pink elastic to keep your journal closed the gold foiled ampersand on the front and you and you know that the quality of the um, Archer and Olive books is always on point you have a pin loop on the side that you can use as well and this is dot grid paper in here you have your intro page this book belongs to and then you have the Archer and Olive logo and their website there on the front and this is um, good quality journaling paper. Um, I don't think that people have too much issue with bleed through with this paper. Um, so yeah, it's good quality, stark white, and it does have the dot grid on it. And I am excited about finally getting to um, journaling. So that was the first book that I purchased. And I don't know that I'm going to use this book first because wait until you see the second one. There's also a pocket back here where you can store things if you would like to. If you want to keep some stickers or things in this pocket in the back, there's a pocket back there for you. Okay, so this is a stunner for sure. It's pink, so you know it's for me. But, <laughs> but hold thine horses because... Wait till you see this next one, y'all. All right, so this one was, you know, I saw the pink one and I put it in my cart. <laughs> but this one in this box, she was a winner, okay? Period. Check her out. <sighs> Look at this journal, y'all. Let me take this little cover off. And let me tell you a little bit more. Oh, look at her. Look at her. Look at her. What? <laughs> I think this is going to be the first one that we start with. I think we're going to start with her. And I might even need to get a second copy of this one because it's just, it's just so gorgeous. Are you kidding me? <sighs> Y'all know that's beautiful. Okay, so let me give you a little bit more information about the Archer and Olive dot grid notebook. It has 160 GSM ultra thick paper. No ghosting or bleeding. Perfect for markers, fountain pens, and even paint. What? Paint? Okay. 160 dot grid pages. So, like I said, you know this is going to be good quality journaling paper. So, you've got this black um, elastic. I think this is a collaboration with... Ooh, who is this a collab with? 
Let me look at my, do I have my receipt? Okay, so I had to take a moment and look it up online, but this is a collaboration with an artist named B. Harris, B-E-E -E Harris. And when I say this journal is, you looking at it, you see, <laughs> you see it's beautiful, right? <sighs> it is gore. Look, look at this. Like, are you kidding me? I may go back and buy another one before they sell out. Just, I mean, it's a stunner. So on the inside, you do have the intro page. And um, it says this, this uh, book belongs to, place for your name, Arch and Olive logo, and the website. And you have this white, white uh, dot grid journaling paper. And it is good, thick journaling paper y'all so I think this is going to be the journal that I'm going to start with and I have a lot to write about <laughs> I have a lot going on right now so there is plenty for me to write I'm going to be looking up some journaling prompts and um, we're going to get into it so it does have a pin loop on the side and like I showed you it has the elastic and it's good quality. You always get good quality from Archer and Olive. So that's it, y'all. I will come back and show you some of my journaling entries um, very soon. Probably come in and set up the intro page with some beautiful dolls very soon. But that is all that I have to share with you this week. And I hope that you enjoyed this little bit of happy mail. If you did, I hope that you will give this video a big thumbs up. And if you're not already subscribed, I hope you'll take a moment and hit that subscribe button so that you don't miss out on any of my upcoming videos. Make sure you click that notification bell as well. I hope you all are having a great week. Let me know down in the comments if you use a journal and if you've ever purchased anything from Archer and Olive and what are your thoughts on the Archer and Olive journals. I love them. Um, I think they are super high quality journals, but I'd like to hear it back from you. Do you use an Archer and Olive? Have you ever painted in your Archer and Olive? That sounds very interesting to me to use some watercolor uh, paint or maybe even acrylic paints in this journal. I have to check and see um, if most people use watercolors or acrylics. I would venture to guess they mostly use watercolor. I would guess, but I don't know. I don't know. You know, people are adventurous out there. So let me know if you use a journal, if you use an Archer and Olive journal. I am curious. I'm trying to line this um, elastic back up. There we go. I'm curious to know if you ladies use an Archer and Olive journal. Let me know in the comments. I hope you have a great week. I hope that your week is full of love, joy, and most of all, peace. See you next time. <laughs>